about them facts. So listen, Mobile, 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 Alabama is hot. Not hot, but hot. Hot. They had a big bus, a raid on an illegal gambling net. The Mobile, the vice, the vice came and shut it down. Gambling net, cash, and guns. It's a bunch of people. It said 32 grams of marijuana, gun, and money. In a house? On Highland Avenue, a gambling net. Okay, if you say so. But Vice? They live in a bus and a gambling ring bus. They say the department's narcotics vice unit seized 32 grams of marijuana, a gun, and more than $4,000 worth of gambling proceeds yesterday after searching homes near the proceeds. Road on Highland Avenue. We posted a list of the arrests made by MPD, the charges of each person, too. You can find that on Fox10TV.com. And then we have the Crosley Hill Boys. It was a bus with them, too. The boys, the mama, the daddy. <laughs> Whole family, I guess. I don't know. Let's listen to this one. Mobile with deadly narcotics. We're talking methamphetamine, ice, pills, heroin, fentanyl. Federal prosecutors in Mobile agreeing to talk about the case for the first time with a Fox 10 News exclusive about how they busted this organization. It is her mind news after she pulled uh, up to the it killed her daughter. In a search prompted by a strange Facebook messenger call to her daughter's account. I imagine that that was what I was going to roll up on. Never. So. Um, the policemen had just got there, so they hadn't even been upstairs to do their investigation yet. Johnston succumbs to fentanyl, an incredibly potent drug that has wrought havoc across the country. The amount of money changing hands that drew the attention of federal prosecutors. 42 defendants allege the conspirators were responsible for at least four overdose deaths and numerous hospitalizations. What to the end of this house on Crosley Hill Drive in Grand Day? That's where the group gets its nickname, Crosley Hill Boys. One of the defendants even had the initials CHB tattooed on his hand. One That's of the, the house. players, Martin Melton, admitted to dealing drugs from this house owned by his mother and her husband. Annetta Owens and Ed Ray Patterson had pleaded guilty to conspiracy charges. Court records show that they gambled large sums of the drug proceeds at Biloxi Casinos. A January 2018, I've been there. turned up drugs, scales, Ooh. weapons, and ammo. Court records showed that Melton and the other dealers sold methamphetamine ice and then branched out into heroin and fentanyl. The sources were spread across the Gulf Coast. Moss Point, Pascagoula, Theodore. One of the dealers, a record producer named Chad Delavaluse, a.k.a. Chad the Pilot, admitted to buying fentanyl from a supplier in California he sent the drugs through the mail to his home in Lake Forest and other addresses. Much of the dealing took place at the house on Crosley Hill Drive, the so-called Blue House on Dolls Road, and low-end motels off of Interstate 10 in Tillman's Corner. The deaths occurred at the Roadway Inn, later called the Regency Inn. It's gone now. My guess. Even the maze. Fentanyl, a synthetic drug called Grey Death by dealers, often gets added to other drugs. It's up to 100 times stronger than morphine and has fueled a dramatic jump in overdose deaths. The latest provisional government data shows that more than 1,200 people overdosed in the 12-month period ending in November in Alabama. That was up 28% year over year. Assistant U.S. Attorney George, George May says that it's the first time in his career that the cutting agent 
is more powerful than the drug itself. Oh, the cutting According agent. to testimony from an expert witness last month who told jurors about enough fentanyl to cover the... So the cutting, he testified the breakdown, more potent than the actual dose, drug. And I think it was wow. 10 milligrams, which is a very small quantity. He says that it's the first time in his career that the cutting agent is more powerful than the drug itself. He pointed to testimony to cover the date of a penny. He testified that was a deadly amount of fentanyl, deadly dose. Now, I don't know how many druggies we have out here that, that uh, taps into Auntie V. But, baby, uh, right now may be the time that you may want to stop because you don't know what they're cutting. Whatever it is uh, you're you taking or you're using with what, what they're cutting it with. Because this right here, this right here, and this right here, even though it's all the same, going to kill you. For real, for sure. So this may be a time that you may want to get yourself clean if you if you want to continue to live on this side of the grass, on this side of the dirt. Because this right here, this right here, and this right here is designed to kill you.